Let me roll up my sleeves. Okay, ladies, it is week two of being a full-time or what feels like a full-time dance mom to me. And I'm slowly but surely getting the hang of it. Not only my dance mom, my son is also starting back with basketball. He took a season off. Luckily, my husband is the coach, so I never have to worry about carpool for that. But also needing to be there too. There has been a hard struggle with the balance of literally being at the studio every single day of the week except for Sunday and trying to make up time to you know pop in here and there with basketball practices and of course I have to be at the games um, on game days so as I settle into it I am excited to say that this is the first time I'm filming for you guys before dance and I'm not rushing matter of fact we don't have to leave the house for another hour my hair is nice and slay for you guys and I can chill plan out my schedule for tomorrow even start editing this video for you guys and I am not rushing who am I I don't know but I am super excited and I'm gonna be bringing you guys on this journey this dance mom journey and just my whole life in general so stay tuned for the vlogs coming up now that I've said all that and giving you an earful today I've teamed up with Eunice and they sent over this beautiful silky straight lace wig as you guys can see she is long and luscious this is a pre everything wig which means that the lace was pre-cut and it had the scallop cut the knots were pre-bleached and then the hairline is nicely pre-plucked they even included the wig ear tab tape wig tape ear tape not quite sure the no matter what you call it I was able to install this one glueless and just use the ear tabs that they provided to peel and stick the wig down add a little sideburn action for a little sassiness and we did a no baby hair look I know I always do baby hair so I had to switch it up and give you guys a no baby hair look today and the center of the wig is not bonded down she is melted but here there is no glue no gel no spray we only bonded her down with those ear tapes that they provided so this is a banger so I'm gonna go ahead and jump into the install take a little break a little siesta if you will before we head out to dance be sure to check the description box for a direct link and all the details on my wig and without further ado let's get right into the video okay ladies let's get right into the video today we're working with a 13 by 4 pre everything 24 inch straight wig this one does come courtesy of units and it's available on amazon prime here's a look at the hairline as well as all the details i wanted to show you guys with paper behind it as well as just freehand as you guys can see this one is a pre everything wig which means the lace is pre-cut with that beautiful scallop cut the knots are pre-bleached and the hairline is pre-plucked i can't forget that you do have these two ear tabs on each side and they did give you extra strips as well and the ear tabs are pretty much like ear tape I guess you can call it is a better word for it so I went ahead and adjusted those adjustable straps at the back you can remove these if you don't like these and then we can go ahead and put the wig on so this is what she looks like on step one is always just to adjust your wig and find your center find exactly where you want your wig to sit if you're like me and have a big forehead you probably have a lot of space and coverage to, to choose from I went ahead and put mine at a good enough space that if I want to add baby hair I for sure have enough space but not too far back you know not too much now we're going to go ahead and just customize this one to my own hairline although she fits like a glove there is a little bit of extra ear tabs as I like to call it around the ears and those little pieces you can keep and those will help you to have like super super fleeky like sideburns I like to cut as much as I can of that off and have the wig cut cuff the rip so that the wig cuffs around my ear and then I peel off the back of that tape and as you guys can see you can pretty much just bond it down from there now I did add a non glue extra hold hairspray and I'm gonna use this because when it dries up it's gonna dry like an adhesive you can also remove it with simple just water and sometimes I just take it off as is but this is just gonna give me a better melt even though we have that ear tape we want to look melted as well and then I went ahead and blow dried it on a cool setting until I got the desired look and we are repeating that exact same step on the opposite side literally just peeling off the back of that wig tape apply a little bit of the bedhead product place the lace down and press it in and then blow dry until it feels nice and dry and then from here we are all installed now because this one fits glueless I did not take the ear tape up top and then I also did not add any of that non glue adhesive up top it's simply just not necessary because this one fits so good as a glueless wig and then from here 
we're going to just make everything match up. I did use the Ruby Kisses Cream Foundation along the parting as well as the powder, the mineral powder along the hairline. And this is going to make everything blend with my skin. Now we can go in and do the dynamic duo. This here is the wax stick paired with the electric hot comb. And I'm kind of just speeding it up so you guys can just see the evolution. This one was nice and flat as a bust down middle part, but we were able to get it even flatter. And then I had to fly out of the house to go pick up my youngest from school. So I had to literally just change into some decent clothes, put on some glasses because although my makeup is done, I don't have on lashes. So sometimes I feel like I look like an alien or I look half asleep. And then we are back and I'm just going to finish doing everything that I started with I did trim down those sideburns just to give a little bit shorter of a look because the hair is nice and long and I kind of just go in and kind of do it a little bit jagged so it's not too blunt and then I did curl them under but because we did not bump the ends and we kept everything else bone straight you'll see in the end I did straighten it back here I'm reminding you that this one does fit glueless because although the ear tabs or ear tape is bonding the sides down the center is still glueless and as you guys can see still flawless now that everything is how we want it let's go ahead and just simply melt it down whether you use glue or no glue adding a melt belt on top and letting it sit for a little while definitely is a game changer and it will literally allow that lace to marry your forehead or your hairline and definitely give you the, the look and definitely give you the best look and the best install that you have ever seen ever once we let that set and straighten out the ends this was the final look Okay, ladies, I think we are officially done with this look. Now, this is the first, this is the third time me sitting down with this look for you guys because I went ahead and installed between kid drop off at the first school and kid drop off the second school. And then it became time to drop off my youngest at her school. So I had to like jet out of here. And then we went on our Wednesday day, day date, my husband and I, that is. And when we came back, we had like 15 minutes because we had to come home and and do a couple things and I was able to come back and I thought I had enough time to finish with you guys and I didn't so we did all three school picked up all three kids from school but from two schools I went down and got them some lunch going I got them going with their homework so they're right now supposed to be doing homework and I'm back and the hair looks gorgeous now you guys know I am a little bit self-conscious you guys love the wig installs with no baby hair I personally love a good a good baby hair situation and I feel like there's so many different ways that you can do baby hair with this one but I did want to do a straight out of the box wig install for you and give you guys what you want give the people what they need if you will so we are gonna do no baby hair but I did keep it real and do the sideburns now I did trim them short and add a little curl I think I'm gonna just bump it and keep it straight because none of the other hair is curled although you guys can see I curled these a few hours ago and they're still curly um so you can tell that this wig will hold a curl really nicely um but you can even make these even shorter or make them into sideburns I typically don't want to do sideburns unless I'm gonna do other baby hair or like if it's textured hair so I think we're done and I feel a little bit weird because doing a straight buzz down middle part is just too easy it's just this is the one that I know that no matter what I got it in the bag I'm gonna be able to slay it every time look at the sheen on this one and how beautiful the length is she's full all the way down to the ends so you don't have to worry about it like being sparse by any means and i just feel like because i had it behind my ear for a little while i find myself having to go back in and touch up that little piece when it gets crimped here and there my son is doing his reading for class so let me go ahead and close my door really quick i should go in there and take my vlog camera set it up so that like i can get some b-roll of papa doing his reading and his homework and then set it up in the girl room and get some b-roll of them i have so many ideas when it comes to vlogs and giving you guys a little extra content and a little bit of a deeper look into our lives i don't want to just talk about it. i want to show you guys the homework routine you know behind the scenes of me filming all different types of content us out and about what we eat all of the things so make sure you are subscribed because all of that is coming especially for vlogmas but i did want to show you guys the packaging before we go i don't remember if i did this already so if i did i'll do it again you guys know Eunice has this beautiful pinkish purplish magenta packaging and inside they did give us some goodies we did get a melt belt which you guys see me use a melt belt in the video um I have a bunch of these courtesy of Eunice so this one I'll keep for you all 
inside the actual bag that had the wig were these little extra pieces of wig tape and it's pretty much double-sided wig tape and there's a bunch of strips like this looks like one but it's actually stacked and it's like a bunch of different pieces so you'll be able to remove the wig tape that's already in there because we did cut off a little bit of the ear tab you can kind of like reapply it and move it up wherever you want in the wig if you want or just through maintenance and washing your wig you may have to take it off and then reapply a fresh one after you dry your wig which is typically what I would do they also gave us a pack of HD wig caps and these are private label from Eunice who you know and then also we did get our nails and these are some nice press ons that will get you through some some good times because you know a lot of times you know you want to go ahead and get your nails done fresh but at the 11th hour you realize you're out of time it's great to be able to have something like this to kind of save the day especially for travel especially for special events even if you just going like on a date or something like that you going on a date tonight you didn't have time to get your nails done or maybe you just wasn't in the budget you got your nails and it came with your wig how amazing is that <laughs> So this is the wig in all its glory. I'll have a link and all the details down below. Be sure to check her out. Also on your way out, go ahead and subscribe. It'll help me out so much. And if you wanna be in tune with what I got going on coming up, make sure you turn on your post notifications. There's also a wig sale going on, so I'll have the link to that down below as well. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like this video and share with your friends. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Smooches.